Hey there, I'm Nick from Agility Rider. In this video, I'll walk you through a simple step-by-step -step process which shows you how to create a topical map in just a few minutes using Agility Rider. You'll learn what a topical map is and its role in both general SEO and semantic SEO, as well as what both of these terms mean. By the end of this video, you'll know how to use topical maps effectively to organize your website's content and improve your SEO efforts. Also, just a heads up, this video is a synopsis of the original post at agilitywriter.ai. You can find the link to the original article in the video description below. All right, let's jump in. So what is a topical map? Firstly, let's talk about what a topical map actually is in general SEO context. Think of a topical map as a blueprint for your website. It means covering a central topic to its entirety while also covering and linking to all related subtopics. This makes it easier for users to navigate your site and signals to search engines that your content is comprehensive, making your site both user-friendly and search engine-friendly. Topical Maps in Semantic SEO In the context of semantic SEO, a topical map is a structured representation of a website's content designed to achieve topical authority by ensuring comprehensive coverage of a central entity and its attributes. It involves organizing content into core and outer sections to reflect both the main and minor aspects of a topic. General versus semantic SEO for creating a topical map. When it comes to creating a topical map, the choice between general and semantic SEO can make all the difference. Let's explore the differences to find out what suits your goals best. General topical maps focus on boosting rankings by organizing content around a main topic and its subtopics, using keywords in a straightforward hierarchy. On the other hand, semantic SEO builds topical authority by building a semantically rich content network that connects related concepts, offering comprehensive coverage beyond just keywords. Creating a topical map focused on semantic SEO can be a challenge, but Agility Writer's Topical Map Helper simplifies the process using both methods, reduces your workload, and produces effective results. All right, let's go. Step 1. Generating a Topical Map Go to Agility Writer and click on the New Topical Map Helper button. Here, enter your main topic and select whether you're creating a map for a niche site or a local business. If you're a local business, you can customize your map by setting the coverage area. Next, choose your preferred language, target region, and AI model. Once you've entered your details, click on the Step 1 button to create your content strategy and wait for the system to work. This process usually takes about one to two minutes. Once your content strategy is ready, you can review it and make sure it aligns with your website's goals. Check if the central entity's URL is correctly linked to your main topic. You can easily adjust it manually if necessary. Once you're happy with your adjustments, click Step 2 to generate your topical map. This may take 5 to 10 minutes. And that's it! Your topical map is ready to use. Step 2. Understanding the topical map. After this, step two is to understand your topical map, which means exploring how each part helps organize your content. Firstly, there's the main core section that covers your most important topics, the primary content areas of your site. Next, we have the supplementary outer section. This part offers supporting content that enhances your main topic. If you're a local business, the main location column offers area-specific content ideas. For your niche site, the main preposition lists topics related to the main subject with prepositions, adding more depth to your content. Then there's the supplementary question section, which features subtopics as questions related to your main topic. For niche sites, supplementary comparison lists subtopics for comparing different aspects of your main topic. Each entry comes with a topic, the subject of your article, and a suggested article title. Agility Writer lets you tweak these titles so that you can better match your main keyword. The main keyword column shows you the key term for each article, and the description gives you tips on how to structure your content. You'll also find local vol and global vol for search volumes, CPC for cost per click, and status to track article progress. Now time for step three, using the topical map. Agility Writer helps avoid duplicate content, but we recommend checking for repeated topics and removing them for clarity. All right, now it's time to start writing your article. Agility Writer makes writing individual articles or handling batch writing super easy. To write an individual article, click the icon next to the topic in the Write column. This will open up Advanced Mode, where you'll get recommendations for the article title, main keyword, and outline instructions. Apply the optimized settings to generate your article, and you're good to go. 
To write in batches, search and filter the articles by section, then click Export CSV for Bulk Advanced Mode. Next, head over to Bulk Advanced Mode, upload your CSV file, and adjust the settings to get everything rolling. And that's it! You've learned how to use Agility Writer's Topical Map Helper to create your own topical map in minutes. If you want to learn more, you can check out the original article in the description below or visit agilitywriter.ai. Thanks for watching!